and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube. Let's play some ranked. We've been doing some expeditions here recently. They've been a ton of fun for sure, but we need to rank up. We need to try to get to that master's rank. We're still kind of playing on a limited uh, collection a little bit. You know, this is like third day of us playing and uh, we're still, you know, acquiring more and more good cards. But the best deck that I probably have right now is Spider Aggro. That's what we're going to be playing over in ranked. We are at, um, we we're past iron. We're now in bronze, but we're just at the beginning part, basically bronze four. Uh, so kind of checking out the deck a little bit. I'm putting, I'll put a code to the deck. So I, I figured, I now figured out that you can put codes to decks so you can copy the deck over. It's one that, that, uh, like I said, I, I haven't spent any money on the game and just put it together basically with the cards that they give you. Um, I did use some wild cards on some um, on some of uh, the commons, whatever they're called, like the uh, some of these things. Like um, what did I use? I got ravenous butchers. Uh, what are those called? Like they're like the common cards, you know? Because I had a good amount of common wild cards now after like three days, but I got some some ravenous butchers for the deck and some cursed keepers. Um, got a couple that got some of those also, and maybe like one other thing. Um, yeah, what are the, what are the green cards called? I know there are wild cards, but what type? I don't remember what they're called. Anyway, here we go. Iron four. Let's go. Let's see what we can level up. We're going to play for a, about an hour and a half, maybe a little less. They are just called commons. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's okay, Bertilux. Okay, so, so they are just commons. Okay, so that is the correct term. Okay, so yes, we got... So I just used a couple of, of common wild cards to kind of upgrade the deck a little bit. But, uh, you know, that's it. Yeah, so that's right. So common, rare, epic, and then champion. All right, we're going to put back the five drop. But that's it. I like the rest of these. Elise is definitely my best card that I want to see right away. And our spider aggro deck. Basically, what our our goal of our deck is to get Elise in play and have three other spiders and transform Elise, and that makes all of our other spiders give them all challenger and fearsome. That's definitely the the goal of the deck. I follow you anywhere. I know just the place. Oh, I didn't get the pen and paper for the desk. It's, it's I. My pen and paper is packed somewhere, in one in some of these boxes. Uh, I must get out of here. So Elise is kind of like Legion War Boss. Like whenever you attack, you make a one one. I mean, Legion War Boss just always makes a one one. But, um. Ooh. So I want to just attack with everything because they would still be able to eat something anyway. The That's one tough defender right there. We got three mana. Do, 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 do. If only those suitors were as lovely as you. Oh. Oh, yes. I love you. Sorry, sending a message real quick. So I want to attack with this, this. This should give me another spider.
Like if they block this thing, I get a spider and then my Elise will flip. We can of course kill our own thing and draw two. <laughs> Thanks Rex. Thanks for the talent points. And they don't even take damage. But I I want to play this crowd favorite this turn with my four mana. And so I want as many creatures as possible in play. Ready for deployment. This is going to be kind of difficult to get through all this stuff. Ready to do my part. When you summon an elite, reduce my cost by one. Okay. Smooth as Oh gosh, that just gives all their allies plus one, plus one. I guess it, it includes itself, and then gets an extra plus one, plus one for the Battlesmith. Um, I've got just the thing for you. This kind of looks rough. This thing can't block. I don't know, maybe I should be maybe I should be chump blocking with another thing. Give me a little bit more room. Oh, that's a good good card to draw. Give all the other spiders plus two plus zero. That's a great card to draw. Discipline and steel. Okay, so I want this to trade with this and I want this to trade with this and then I think I let the crowd favorite just trade with something and I guess I should trade the 5-3 with one of these tough 4-4s four and then you obviously just attack and then Elise could just trade off a lease also. Basically just try to trade everything. No. Demacian steel protects me. Thanks, Frisky Biscuits. Okay, what do we got? We got Zed, so that's pretty good. So this would be a 4-4 four, four right now. 
I mean, it's better to play the other stuff first, but then we, we probably won't be able to block with the other stuff. Or at least... Won't be able to block with this. So we have... That's... Actually, that's fine. I'm at nine. Yeah, okay. We'll, we'll go this route. So we're going to play this. Get some more spooky spiders. And then if they just go to attacks... I'm going to kill this ally to and make a 4-4 four, four to draw two, and then I'll be able to block with that 4-4. Four, four. We'll be able to block Zed with that 4-4. Four, four. I assume that's Oh, does that is that not how that works? Uh maybe that's not how that works. Gross. Gross. Ouch. Yeah, I can't block then sacrifice because it, this thing can't block. And the problem with... This just didn't work. This just didn't work at all for me. I should have just played the crowd favorite as the 4-4 instead of playing the spider. I didn't realize that I wouldn't be able to block with that card. Embrace the shadow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, why can't I why couldn't I play something? I still had like four mana. What is going on? What? It is just making me pass super fast. What is going on? I was trying to play stuff. It was just like saying, no, you can't play stuff. Thing still can't block. Okay, yeah, I'm just dead. Well, that was really frustrating. That was just all frustrating how all of that worked. Like the last few turns. You know, that I, you know, didn't get to block with like the 4 4 that I thought I was going to be able to. And then didn't play stuff, and yeah. So I guess I so I roped once and then the time gets reduced a lot and then it just goes really fast after you rope. Still learning, you know, still still learning about all this stuff. 
That was a game I was feeling pretty good about, and then kind of all went away. All right, let's get some new cards. All right, Thrice. Take care. The Precious Pet. It's a good card. Being fearsome. Oh, but I want to attack. I pull the string. Come closer. I don't bite. We use a bite. We got a spooky spider mirror. Spooky spider mirror. Strength and grace, beauty is the blade. Run them through. Aha. All right, so they're going to be able to just kill my two one. But now, since we added an, al an ally die, we can do three. We're going to kill the Elise. I'm also going to play a Crawling Sensation. That is weird that like you put a slow spell on the stack after the other spell. It's kind of weird. A little weird. That's true. If I would have just done Vile Feast, I could have leveled Elise. That's that's a good point. I could have. Um, so I kind of want to do that this turn with the Vile Feast, but then we just waste two mana... Well, it's definitely not worth it to do the Vile Feast now. <clears throat> so 4-3 Fearsome that gets a 2-2. Two -two. Also along with it. That's pretty good. But I guess it has to hit the Allegiance thing. Dude, this battering ram is sweet. An O12. Every time it attacks, it gets plus four permanently. So, you know, it attacks the first turn as a 412, and the next turn as an 812, and so on. Level up, you've seen six units die. Oh, yeah. Thresh. Thresh is pretty good. <laughs> I know. Why are more people playing Arcbow? Battering Ram. Let's do when this levels up. 4-7, the first time I attack this game, summon an attack and champion from your deck or hand. Well, it's already would have attacked. Oh, I guess, does it mean like after it levels up, then the first time it attacks, after it leveled up? I guess that would make sense. <clears throat> what are all these instants? Yeah, so first attack after the level up. Uh, 
Well, that's definitely going to hurt. They're at four out of six. Um, you can't block. Isn't it good just to do this block? I think it is. I feel like that's a good block. That does mean their thing's going to level up. I think that's okay. And yeah, I could kill their 1-1 and make a 1-1 of my own. You expect Rasa here? What does Rasa do? At least that's not a champion. What are they doing? Kill that to draw two? So we can do this so they don't draw two? Gonna try to trample. Attack. So this thing's gonna be an eight nine trampler. This is a ten five trampler. That's eighteen trample damage. They have six life and seven toughness. So yeah, they're gonna have to have instant speed removal for this thing. Which it looks like they do. Remove all text and keywords so that uh so it goes back down to zero power. And then give two allies plus three plus three. That's fine. I still I like that trade. I like getting that rid of that thing. Um Hey, Dark Light. Welcome. We got some some sweet Legends of Runeterra action going on. We got we're doing some ranked now with Spider Aggro. I lost the first one. Oh no, they have another Thresh. Uh oh. So that thing's gonna attack. And they just get a champion. Yeah, this game is sweet. Yeah, I agree. This game's awesome. So they get a Hikarum attack in. I don't know what this thing does, but it's crazy. So it's a 4 6. Hmm. Oh, yeah, you still can't block. So I just have you block a 4-6. You can block 3-1, can block a 3-2. And I'll just take 7.
And we'll see if we can get two points of damage across. Just go to attacks or no? Because I mean, this is like two creatures here. Oh wait, wait, wait. no, because I don't, I don't have room for two creatures. Because I, I have five, so two would be seven. We don't have room for that. Oh, because that thing doesn't have trample anymore, so I could kill that to get trample again. That's that's not a bad call. Um, but then they get to play another blocker. But that's, yeah, that's actually a good call. And then turn this thing into uh, 12 toughness again. The now is trample again. Hey, Darklight getting the sub gift. Thank you, Frisky Biscuits. So yeah, Darklight, I'm playing this game every day here at this time. Um, 3 to 10 Eastern time. Every day. Join the conflagration. For a good seven hours. Alright, what do they got? Kill that ally draw two. <laughs> it's two AM for you right now. Well I start yeah, started five hours. I guess this is five hours twenty two minutes ago. So yeah, but basically late night for you. Victory! All right. Just start playing the game um, three days ago, but it's awesome. All right, gotta get this last chest. Because level 13 is the last level you can get, right? With the chest. GG's. Yep, it's the last one. Alright, so we're at 12. Okay, sorry. Um, it's kind of a good hand. I'm gonna keep it. Wow, just got better. That was probably like our best. I mean, that was definitely our best turn one draw. This spider is fearsome. So they can only block with creatures power three or greater. Elise. I pull the string. You also have an Elise. What's your hurry? You dare. Alright, so we're just gonna go ahead and go attack with both. We can use a bite. They block my spider. Presumably. Yeah, you can play someone from different regions. Yep, absolutely. 
Um, but like you basically you just get two regions for a deck, but you can play you know anybody from any regions. Um, oh, if you're talking about like re in like the world, like can somebody from U.S. play someone from Europe? I I don't know about that. All right, gonna kill this to draw two. Make two more little spooky spiders so we can flip Elise. You'll serve me one way or another. So yeah, server regions, I don't know. Let me change into something more. Um, kill an ally, then revive it. Let's get this thing in play. Guess I should have done this first. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Smooth as silk. Ouch, this is not good. So I do want to grasp the Undying, the Elise, but I want to play other stuff for my turn first. I can do that during their turn whenever they go like straight to combat kind of thing. I think I could just do that and then block other things, but I guess maybe not. No, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know, Frisky Biscuits. I don't know. It's not really on, on the schedule right now. I'm really enjoying the new game. Okay, so I... Guess I don't get to kill this thing first. Cause then I, I get to, I can't, yeah, I can't actually block other stuff. Yeah, Runeterra is really sweet. If y'all haven't checked this game out yet, I'd, I'd recommend it. For sure. Don't think I'm really surviving this. But, well, maybe.
Get to at least survive for another turn. So next turn's turn seven. Of course, at nowhere near the amount of viewers that we had before, but I'm hoping that picks up. I want to give this a real, give it a real shot instead of just trying it for like you know two days and then saying nope, it's not as many viewers, quit. All these things are fearsome. And all my creatures are so small. Kind of need to play this to get some bigger creatures. Man, I probably should have just attacked with this 4 3 first and then made two spiders and then played the 5 3. That's probably the order that I should have done that in. Oh, third biggest rune terror streamer at the moment. Sweet. Stand strong. Yeah, I mean, I think I think like this weekend is a lot more magic viewers because the world championship and everything too. Over the last like two weeks, like or like you know week, like whenever I wasn't streaming, when I was looking at it, Runeterra almost always had more. Uh, almost always had more viewers. But that doesn't mean that it always does. Of course. I couldn't respond still. No. After drawing that, I wanted to respond and drain one from my own unit and make a spider, and then they wouldn't get a spider. Oh, gosh. I think I'm just dead. I think I needed to wait before I played the host. I'm pretty sure I'm just dead. Oh, yeah, because then they're, they're going to have the 1-1. One, one. They're going to force me to block this with the 1-1. One, one. Yeah. I needed to drain last turn, not play this other thing last turn. I've not played these games very well. Kind of wearing down a little bit. Did we get rewards? Okay, we got a capsule from the Shadow Isles. Yeah, I hope so, Walker. <laughs> oh, is, I don't know, is it on auto pass or something? Is there, is there a setting? Is there a setting? Man, my back is really bothering me today. I 
Um, yeah, I'm just swapping off magic for, for a little while, Hamburglar. For a little while, at least. Yeah, I've been playing magic for like the last 10 years. It's like my only card game, and I just want to give, give a new game a shot, especially how this one just came out and looks really cool. Oh, it was on the page I just opened? My back is hurting. All right, um, let's see. I'm gonna keep these. Oh, enable auto pass. Okay. Figured it out. Where are you? I guess I like auto pass most of the time. <laughs> hey, Runeter actually runs on a Mac. Nice. Come closer. I don't fight. Attack. I'm thinking about changing my name from Todd Stevens MTG because I think that I think people like um I don't really like having the MTG in my name. I think people may like look at this game and see that and and less likely to watch my channel. So I'm thinking about changing that name and changing it to like Hawktie or Hawktie Gaming. What do y'all think of the the Hawktie name? All right, tradesies. play as a 4-4. You, you think I should just, just have Todd Stevens? Yeah, it would be feel weird to see me stream under a different name. Um, I d did see like on Twitch, somebody already has just the name Todd Stevens on Twitch. And somebody already has the name Hawktie. But yeah, I could do like Hawktie Gaming. Or something kind of like that. Reporting in. <laughs> yeah, y'all are used to the Todd Stevens. A lot of the other, like, you know, big streamers, like, you know, people don't really use their name too much.
Yeah, I would definitely I would change the YouTube videos to be the same as this. Yeah, I mean, I would, I would definitely change YouTube as well. All right, so we're going to just go ahead and attack with both. And I assume they're going to throw their 1-1 one, one in front of my 4-1, just the obvious choice. And then I'm going to drain it. I guess I maybe I should have played the Darius first, honestly. I probably should have played Darius first. I think CCG, like Hawktie CCG. I know what lurks in the shadow. Probably should just play this pre-combat. My axe is ready. Because I still had the mana to do that trick. You suffer long. Hmm. Now I'm at sixteen. They probably, you know, could have plus three, plus zero. I don't really know of too much, like, plus four or four damage. There's, like, three damage stuff. So I think this is a safe block. But we'll see. Yeah, we do need to finish Luigi for sure. I haven't said I. I honestly haven't pulled the switch out of the box yet. I have to set up, set the switch up and everything again. I'm going to be ugh. so I can I can use might and save this thing. Yeah, we'll we'll do that. The um, I did find out that I'm I'm gonna just be hooking up the switch to like one of the monitors instead of the TV, so I won't be like looking up at the TV. Could do Hoktai Games instead of Hoktai Gaming. I don't like gamer. I could do games, Hoktai Games. Hawktie Gaming. Hawktie TV. Hawktie Live. Like, my Twitch name could just be Hawktie Live, and on YouTube, just Hawktie. Uh, Yeah, I didn't think of Rasa, but yeah, I guess, yeah, I guess I would did not block now. For sure. Yeah, I mean, I guess I just shouldn't have blocked because of Rasa. 
Yeah, this this game definitely feel like felt like it feels like it got away from me. That I had the cards to win, and I'm just not winning. Yeah, it's just stuff I got to get used to playing around. You know, it's the word about like the four damage. It will all be over soon. There's a good chance they use their 3-2 to block my 1-1, one, one, and that then I can get double Noxion gu Guillotine. So. Yeah, my, my Runeterra videos are up on YouTube right now. There's the YouTube channel. You can see all the ones from the last two days. Yeah, there, there's the link to the YouTube channel. Uh, YouTube.com slash ToddStevensMTG. No, so then then is my thing gonna fizzle so I don't get to use it again? Or the No, it is does fizzle, I don't get to use it again. Rough. Oh gosh, now they have a Darius. Um Cause I mean they're just gonna go straight to attackers. Ouch. He's gonna kill that 4 1 also. But yeah, and I, I have both expeditions that we played earlier today. They're both up there now. There's nothing to fear. This is not a good draw. My opponent just had a lot more, you know, top end powerful cards than me. I'm just overwhelmed. Overwhelmed me. Oh, that's... Yeah, that's... I mean, I'm dead. Darius flips. Hmm. Yeah, that those Rosses, those yeah, those Rosses were maybe a beating. Need to get better. Need to get better. Um yeah, I mean, we did we did a lot better with the quick aggro deck the other day. We were six one and ranked with that one. All 
All right, let's see what we got. Let's get rid of this, this, and this. We'll keep the undying. Okay, this is good. This is good. <clears throat> we'll take this. So I'm going to just play this Cursed Keeper and then kill it. And then attack for seven. Oh, we don't get the attack token. Attack. Well, that's rough. Wish I would have played this undy undying first. With that being their plan. Runeterra is really cool. Uh, Snarecrow, yeah. These this game is pretty sad. awesome. So this thing's just... So it's elusive in lifesteal? Hmm. Get another glimpse beyond. Which one? What's glimpse beyond? Which which card's that? The sack draw too? Okay. It's the best card draw in the game? Okay. My heart and soul for Demacia. Fear is the first of many foes. Eyes open. Alright, we're gonna kill this Garen. That thing out of here. I know what lurks in the shadows. And they blocked my 2 2. I'm happy about that because now it comes back as a 3 3. That card's kind of cool. Like every time it dies, it just comes back with plus one, plus one. So now if it dies again, it comes back as a 4 4 and so on. We can do this. Looks. It doesn't. It doesn't block though. I wish it blocked. Strike for the balance. Man, now I have battering ram. The manor would be so lonely without you. Yeah, the I really like the battering ram. It's been sweet. The one game we won, battering ram was was a big part of it. 
but this is I just kind of set this up, you know, with with all of this. But but yeah, the battering ram, sweet. Soldiers to me. All right, you're attacking, you're attacking, and that's it. Because I want my spiders. I want to flip Elise. But these are just free attacks. <clears throat> Let me change into something more. Come together. Yay, Glimpse Beyond. Yeah, that is a good good card to draw for sure. We can turn this thing into a 4-4. Give all allies plus 3, plus 3 this round. Um, actually, let's kill this thing and make a 4-4 this way for another blocker. You're like Demacia Noxus combo, because you can purify your own 5 4 that can't block to surprise your opponent. Oh, okay. Yeah, that is a good combo. I like that. Yeah, that is a good combo. Courage, soldier. I've been hiding my life too long. Um, that's bad. That's very bad. Not good. So yeah, they gain five life. This thing is basically has life link. I don't know why they didn't attack with our seven eight. Honestly. Meet them head on. Attack. I need to kill this. Flyer at the life steal, but I guess killing Lux is probably pretty important too. All right, what you got, opponent? What you got? Eyes open. Uh, what does that card do? Bounce? Oh, I need to kill that thing. I think it just gives them so many spells. Karma is so good. Ionia. Gotta kill Karma. Especially they need they probably need the extra spells for Lux and everything. You won't get past me. So they so they spent four mana of spells, they need to spend two more, and then they get a final spark in hand. Wait, what happened? Ionius oh. Through me. Hmm. So that thing just transforms automatically, huh? I guess so. Okay, so they're going for a combo. 
So yeah, I didn't realize the thing just transformed if you got 10 mana because you know like it says five. You know like I, I would have thought that you would have had to have the full 10, but I guess it just checks like the bars. You know like we got we're at you know turn 10. So they can do a one shot kill, basically. I mean I'm at eight, so just something that does like four damage to me. Does this do four damage to any target? Stop. No, just to a unit. What? Why did you do four damage to me? What is going on over here? Flicks damage beyond what would kill the targets to the enemy nexus. Ah. Um. So yeah, so I'm just dead now. Can I... These are fast. Can I maybe make these fizzle? That's what I'm going to try to do. I'm going to hope this works. Nope. Did not work. Did not work. <laughs> yeah, that was a lot of power there. All right. Um, so we're saying we need the third glimpse beyond. I think I, I mean, I think I have three of those, I think. No, I just have two. Never mind. Definitely seems like the deck's not powerful enough in like the mid late game. I do have another arachnid host I could put in here? These curse keepers really haven't been that great, honestly. I don't think I want three of them. Maybe get a third one of these in. Hey, what's up, King J? I don't know. I'm going to just keep it the same. How do I play? Play a match. There we go. You recommend Decimate is won some games for you. And the King J, 28 awesome months. Thanks for that. Thanks for the resub.
All right, so turn two, I can play the spider with the butcher. Oh, that's a great turn one play. Uh, but we're not... Where's my we don't get to attack right away. So if you do this archetype with Freljord, like what would... What do you mean like this archetype? Like spiders? But like there's so much of the spiders that are... Like they're in two different... Clans, if that makes sense. They're in two different regions. This is an aggressive start here. I'll do better this time. Oh, just the sacrifice theme. Okay. So you're play the Shadow Isle, sacrifice stuff. Not spiders. Do sacrifice in, in Frel Jordan. Mistraith. Nice little 2 2. Alright, attack, attack, attack. Shouldn't really attack with our 2 2 into their 3 3. Yeah, this was a great start for us. Oh no, what is the spell? We got some kind of spell. Oh, that's not bad. That's not bad. Yeah, and then they kill that. It's all right, we already dealt a lot of damage. They're down to four cards. The Undying. All right, we got five mana. We can just kill our, our spider, reset it to be a 2 2 again, and get that extra 1 1. Then I think I'm going to play Darius before attacks. Well, I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe we just go to attacks. We have no blockers out right now. So that thing doesn't block. Yeah, I mean, it's probably just, just supposed to go to attacks. Sweet. All right, back in the win column. Putting that down on the, the right spot. Still getting some good experience. So you're saying check out Decimate. Is that a card that I have? Let me see it real quick. Deal four to the enemy Nexus. That does finish people off. We have we have the eight drop that turns all of our cards, Captain Pharaoh, into Decimates. Which is good enough. I kind of always think about playing like this Ruination just to be like a reset. Probably shouldn't, but I kind of want to. Like I kind of feel like maybe it's better than Withering Whale, you know, that does one to all damage. You know, like 
just something that like you know people don't really expect what do y'all think about just playing like one ruination instead of a withering whale and then like you know you can kind of start aggressive if that's good whatever but Yeah, we're supposed to be fast, but, you know, games don't always play out how you want them to. I have a new champion. I have a Vladimir. We can play a Vladimir or a Draven, but Vladimir seems like it just kills all of our stuff. And Draven doesn't seem very good either. Oh, we, we can put another rear guard in here. Yeah, maybe we just play another rear guard to get another one drop. What is this thing? I haven't seen this card before. I must have just got this. Crimson Aristocrat, deal one to an ally, and granite plus two plus zero. No, we don't really want to do one to our allies. Oh, wait. I guess that does work well with... I guess that's good with the Cursed Keeper, isn't it? Should I play this thing? Maybe I want to play another, a second Black Spear. I'm only playing one. The Black Spears have looked good. Actually, I think that's what I want to do, is just play another Black Spear. Yeah, the Spears have been good. Let's get another... Let's get a second Spear in there. Let's do that. So we got a mirror match. Ooh. That's not good. I don't want the six drop, eight drop right away. Yeah, we just got a mirror match. Want to keep Black Spear to kill Elise. Another six drop. Ouch. What's that noise? It's not a very good mirror hand. That's for sure. Pretty dead. I must get out of here. I'm looking pretty dead. So those things just get plus two plus zero forever? That's pretty strong.
Yeah, I know. The one deck the Withering Wheel would have been good again, so he took it out. That's how it works. Well, that was a good draw, though. We got to kill their 4-1 that I couldn't block, and then basically counter the Decimate. Decimate dealt 4, we gained 3. Yeah, that was a great turn for me. Oh, man. Give all these spiders plus 2 plus 0, or play the Battering Ram. Battering Ram. <clears throat> battering Ram just going to be better and better over time. No, my battering ram. That's my favorite card. My poor battering ram. Probably not attacking in again. We survived that early onslaught, and so we're starting to stabilize. enemy nexus in half last breath put it back in hand then we have the double decimate for next turn got this. Awesome. Okay, we're coming back. We're three and four. We're coming back. And leveled up. Bronze three. Get that 150 match reward. Alright. Yeah, that was a good comeback. That was a good comeback. All right, let's see. We're going to kind of keep all of these. Let's go. I like this Might card. But maybe Might would be better as the Broken Bond. I mean, it probably would be better as Broken Bond. Reporting in. Drain. All 
Alright, so two for two. <laughs> yeah, you're probably right about that, Bertilux. A Demacian soldier is worth ten foes. Because, yeah, this is Broken Bond. So we get a couple of free blocks. Uh, it just you know reduces the toughness of their creatures. Okay, so they're gonna do this one. Get me another spider. Which of course I want the extra spiders because of the arachnid host. They're not gonna give me the four four. Victory lies ahead. Yeah, and, and our deck kind of goes wide, so yeah, the Broken Bond's probably better, because we do try to go wide. Those are good trades for me. attack right away. I mean, I have the Darius that could play first, but I don't want them to play some blocker like Garen for the Darius. Or that makes my attack somehow worse. I'll return to them a stop. I'd like to see you try. Could have been wrong. I don't know. Ooh, that card's good. Um... There's nothing Let's get Elise out here and then play the other host. Keep up the good work. The manor would be so lonely without you. Yeah, I guess that was bad. Man, they got to play this four drop plus this thing that was a six six. It was just a zero. Zero mana six six and then plus four dementia. Wow, that's a lot of mana they just spent this turn. Um What could have been? 
Alright, this isn't good. Officially not good. Yeah, that hurt. Mmm. I know I'm enough to battering ram plus might. And I'm summoned to rally? That's not cool. Find them. Find them. Well, we're gonna stun that. And we'll block here, kill Garen. <clears throat> Should I trade Elise for this 3-3? Three, three? They surrendered? Why would they surrender? They're at 10. Why'd they surrender? I don't know. Maybe something, like something had to have come up that they just had to leave, you know? Or maybe Garen just means that much to them. Yeah, I had to go to the bathroom or something. All right, well, we got a rare wild card. That's good. Mike, have you tried this game out yet? If not, you definitely should. This game is sweet. All right, we're gonna play one more. Actually, I'm not sure, Gemini. That's a good question. Do people in the free expedition runs compete versus the people that pay for, with gems? I honestly do not know the answer to that. Like, I, I don't know. That's a good question, though. I was wondering about that, too. You've not? Oh, yeah, dude. Yeah, you should check this game out. It's pretty cool, like, just the timing and everything. It's just real skill-intensive. I like it a lot. And you know, free. The right price. Alright, so we got our fearsome creatures. They can't block it. Two mana, four, three, elusive. Oh, that card's good. That egg, did it move? Quiet now. Hmm. All right, Mike. Yeah, have a good night. All right, so that thing's a 4-3 because of the Inspiring Mentor. I'm going to sack this. Draw two. And then turn that into a 4-4 that we can attack with the 4-4. Ah. 
Ouch. So we just don't get a 4-4 four four now. I mean, so, you know, they just used removal spell on the 4-4, four four, basically. I'm just going to end the round. I mean, I could just sacrifice this to get the other 1-1, one one, but... No, let's just keep it as is for now. Stay safe. I'll take it from here. Man, another one of those four threes. I don't like our chances. Looks like our our win streak may end here. Alright, so if I just go to attacks. I'm gonna attack with the three twos. Or I'm gonna try to play like the crowd favorite, which will be what a six six. Try to do that. I stand for Nazis. Yep, that's something we need to try to push more damage. Ugh. Well, now attacking with the three twos isn't even good. I mean, I can't. I can't just sit back. Like these things are just going to kill me. So I guess I just have to attack, because I can't sit back. <laughs> Don't want any trouble. Those things I'll definitely kill me. You. How did that move go? So I just have to. Try to get some trades. You know, gotta go for it. Okay. Everything's better with company. Says you. Give all their stuff minus one, minus one. It's too elusive. Too elusive. That one mana one one was just awesome for them. Well, no, I mean, I got to attack. I mean, I got to block with the Zed and the Zed token, so it's not like they had lethal if they attacked with it, because I could have blocked it. Yeah, they got me. They got me. Into darkness. Oh, right. Oh, right. With the Zed, because it summons a creature, so then it would give the the other flyer plus one, plus zero, and they would have dealt the one extra point of damage. That's a good call there. All right, so didn't, didn't do too well with Spider's Aggro tonight. Four and five. We're going to need to work on that deck some more. Um, you know, so finish with a losing record, unfortunately. First time finished with a losing record. But that's all right. So tomorrow, um, hey, ride with some. Thanks, Frisky Biscuits. Thank you. Ride with some getting the sub. So yeah, now I can be sub in the channel. All right. Um, so tomorrow we're going to be doing another expedition, as we talked about, because uh, it resets after tomorrow. So we need to do that. We need to get all the XP 
from the experience that we need from the expedition also. So we're going to be doing that, and then, we're, then we'll uh, play a different deck in Ranked. Maybe we go back to the quick aggro, or maybe we just put together, maybe we just brew something else. We'll kind of look at like what we have in the collection after the expedition, and maybe brew something else for tomorrow. So, all right, uh, there we go. So that's it here for the stream. Those of y'all watching on YouTube, hit that like button over there. Uh, those of y'all here in the channel, check out the YouTube channel, follow along, and uh, you know the other expeditions that we had earlier today, those are up there. Um, so there's the link to the YouTube channel, uh, just youtube.com slash toddsteamsmtg. Um, but that's it here for uh, for some Spiders Aggro, our, our uh, beginner deck that we need to keep upgrading. All right, thank you so much for watching, though, and I will see you for the next video.